Hello guys, Siva Live. So today we have our scouting versus, uh, for Ian for the model type Fall Seasonals Round 4. So Ian's a really, really solid player. Easily top 5 with like Paleo, Clearly, Ridley, Wonka, all those dudes. And he's in Woa, so really tough opponent this week. Let's get right into it. So first we have Steel. We know he has a HO Steel. I think he uses versus Nilek or someone like that. So it would for a tournament or something. And he uses HL Steel as Scarf Bisharp, Z Jirachi. It's like uh, Z Celebrate with T Bolt Psychic. I don't know if it was Calm Mind, like Z Celebrate plus Calm Mind. I'm not really sure. But, and uh, Extra was Scarf. Heatran was like Taunt. It was like a Taunt Magma Storm set with, I think, Shooka Berry. And then SD Offensive Scizor. Fairy, we know he has this standard dot standard fairy, though it didn't show in his replays, but I know he, I think from ULC. He had that team. It's just the standard team from sample teams, whatever, that you can anyone could get. It's ground, I know he has a stall ground. I don't think he'd actually bring this versus to me considering what I use. Um it just doesn't do well versus anything. I'm not really sure what stall ground even does, but I don't think he uses it versus anyone serious anyway. I the team I think he would bring is probably this team. Because gravity is very good versus the teams that I've been spamming lately. Though, I don't think he'd lead off with it. This would be like a game two type thing. Unless I, like if I've used water already, he probably would bring this, not fearing it again. Um, Vin Kuhn Water. I know he had, he put a team out on the sample team. Not on sample teams, but he put out a team and he's been using it a decent amount. It's like the Scarf Keldeo Z Move Gren <coughs> Vin Kuhn team. He also has another variant. He has like two variants. One with the Gasodon and Polion variant. I think Leru or someone popularized and then he also has the other one with the Mantine uh, Sharpedo Greninja that I think you see most often yeah so he has that team for sure electric I didn't see any of uh, poison I didn't see any of uh, flying I didn't see any I'm not gonna bring anything that outward loses to any of these but I just didn't see any of these in his replays and that doesn't mean he wouldn't bring it um, like if he brings flying he's gonna bring that one in the sample teams with Gliscor and all that stuff so next uh, normal he's been tooting his own horn about Encore Pup being like the best set or whatever because it be sound balanced I don't know when I use it, it didn't really do anything <laughs> to be honest but I'd probably still use it anyways if I'm expecting Vin Kuhn. I don't actually like normal that much but you know yeah so Encore Pup, Download B2, this combination actually deals with water. I feel like you'd bring this, possibly. Uh, Toxic Chance, Abandoned, it's just standard team. Like, the big teams I think you'd bring, I'll, I'll go over at the end. Actually, Psychic, I have no fucking idea what he'd use for Psychic. But I'm going to bring teams that all can and will beat Psychic, so I'm not really too, too worried. Because that is his main, for sure. Uh, bug, a uh, dragon. I didn't see any of, but any of, but I know during MPL he used like a Solomon's dragon or something like that, and he definitely has standard dragon. Like this man is like a monotype co-leader. He definitely has all these teams. He probably has every single type, but he wouldn't bring any of these to tournaments. Like fire isn't really that good. Fighting's pretty awful. Ice is pretty bad. Grass is pretty bad. He maybe bring rock, but. I don't know if you bring that versus me considering I'm known to use water and I bring it despite counter teams. Even though like even Monogen I got destroyed by Surskit when he just straight up led grass. Like what? <laughs> anyway. Yeah. So he might have the dragon. Just like standard Altaria dragon. Probably have sample team or something like that. Or maybe something different with a Megalodios. I can see Megalodios versus me for sure. Uh, bug, it's like Mega Scizor Bug with Lee Galvantula. It's like AV Galv uh, Araquanid, Fiery on Volcarona, Spidef, SD Scizor, Scarf Herald. It's a very standard SD uh, Scizor team. And then Dark, it's kind of a weird offensive Dark with Lead Bishar with Rocks, Scarf Gren, DD Mega Tar, and he has a Cacturn, I guess, for like Vincoon, because usually this loses to water anyway. And then Rock. Uh, he may bring rock, maybe, I don't know, maybe trying to super counter team my flying or something like that. Because I've been spamming a lot of flying lately. And it's been having a lot of success for me in tournaments, so, you know, he might try and get that counter team. The thing is, I could still beat rock because I have 
Celesteela, and if it gets defense boost, then it's kind of unkillable for Rock. Even when they're late, I mean, I have enough EVs where I can take the T bolts and stuff if I need to and just knock it out. Because obviously, and then I can protect, get some leftovers, and then bring it in later and get some more lefties. So, what I want to bring, I really want to lead off with Galispod. I have a team that I've been messing around with lately, and it's not that bad versus the teams, though it would be annoying if I got Fairy for sure. But other than Fairy, it kind of beats down a lot of his teams. And considering the stuff that I've been using that actually do beat Fairy, namely like ground, uh, flying, flying especially. I don't know if he'd lead off with Fairy. I think he'd bring Fairy maybe game two or something like that. I'm expecting him to lead off with either Psychic. He may bring Dragon. I could see Dragon for sure. Uh, that'd be scary if he brings Dragon. But I think I can be Dragon with Scarf Grand plus Specs Keldeo. Um, I think he'd lead off with either Dark. It's like Dark, Bug. Dark, Bug, Psychic. Or ground those are like the four that i'm thinking he might lead off as and then second maybe like fairy or normal or something like that if and then game three i'm not really sure it depends like how it goes so i really wanted to lead off with that fairy is as good as always as it's always been it basically beats everything on his team and i don't i could even lead off with fairy too because i do not think he'd lead off with steel especially because of what happened with pcm because i just kind of led gliscor basically never swapped and it was 50 turns of me clicking taunt earthquake and knock off with my gliscor and flying it beats everything as well like flying is great as always uh, flying is really a sleeper type in my in my opinion i think si flying is definitely up there with like normal easily like top five especially with like stuff that i've been using and people think i don't know why mega arrow is c rank man it's like a mon that well it's not like super good it's not a breaker it's definitely not a breaker you're not going to get the same use out of arrow like the same wall breaking potential with arrow what you get out of arrow is a revenge killer as well as something that could revenge kill Kiram. actually hit dragon types one of the matchups that it just kind of flips that matchup on its head also being able to hit like opposing flying as well as if you're running earthquake being able to just kill tapu coco um aerial ace the tapu bulu it's pretty good for its fairy as well so, yeah, those are the things I'm thinking about bringing. <laughs> I guess comments, yeah, he's the GOAT. Like, it's going to be tough. And my plan, I just got to be at the top of my game and outplay and just not get horrible matchups, and we should be good to go. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time with my Battle vs. Ian.